All right, and welcome back to Officer Oil. My name's Scott McAdoo. When I'm not fighting crime, I'm fighting friction. Here with my good friend Joe. We're down at the Bay Area Tire in Goodyear in Severna Park, Maryland, right off of Ritchie Highway. There we go. So today, Joe, now first I want to tell Joe here is like MacGyver. He can fix anything. And so I reached out to him, and we're going to be doing some work here on a construction, on a truck owned by a construction company. It's a 2016 F-250 with a 6.2 liter V8 gas engine. Now Joe here is also, Joe, you are an ASE. That's right, ASE Master Tech. So as we love to say, thank you for your service. So, so we're, he's gonna be helping us out. What we're doing is we're first gonna start out, we're gonna do a full transmission fluid exchange. We're gonna replace the filter. We're gonna do a transfer case change. We're going to do the uh, front differential and rear differential gear oils. But to do that, we're gonna start with the Amsoil engine and transmission flush. You grab that for me, Joe. Awesome. So this here is what we're gonna dump in. I'm gonna talk about it a little bit more in a second, but we're gonna flush out all those old contaminants and everything in there. We're gonna dump this in the trans and we're gonna let it idle for about 15 minutes. So. Joe, what do you think? You want to say we get started with it? Get started. All right, so let's go ahead and dump that guy in there. All right, so we got it all started up. So what we're going to do is we're just going to dump that in. Dump in both bottles because it's a big, lot of trans, big capacity here, big sump, six, over 16 quarts for total fill. So there we go. Please, if you're new to the page, please subscribe and we'd love to hear your comments. But these, but Joe does an incredible job here at Bay Area Tire. Great job. They're going to help you with all your automotive and light truck needs. Bumper to bumper, everything you got. Come in and see them. Nice. All right, so got that, got that all dumped in. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move into the truck and I'm gonna start working through the gears, get that thing cleaning everything out. All right, so we're in the car here. Very important, we don't put a load on this, okay? So what we're gonna do is just work through the gears, park reverse neutral drive, park reverse neutral drive, and we're getting that cleaner to get in there and work through all the passages, all the, the uh, oil cooler, the, all the ports, clean all the varnish off the clutch plates, just do an outstanding job of doing that. But we don't put a load on it. We don't want to drive this. And we only want to do it for 15 minutes. I got my watch running. And so I'm just going to sit here and just work it through. All right, so parking brakes on. So first gear, second gear, manual, drive, neutral, reverse back to park and it's just bringing that fluid back and forth back and forth to clean everything out how we doing joe great. you're doing great park reverse neutral drive So we're gonna keep doing that while my stopwatch is running. All right, so this here, this is what we're doing here. So this is a before the cleanup. So these are those clutch plates inside, pre-cleanup. Look at all that varnish there on the plates, the heavy glazing, and with the AMS oil, that's the after. I'm gonna clean it up great, reduce all a lot of that varnish and build up. But that's the whole purpose of this, okay? So this is, we use two bottles because it does hold up to, because we're between 10 and 20 quarts. But there's your instructions right there. Super easy. And that's what we're using, the Amsoil engine and transmission flush. So while I'm doing this, the beauty of this is it works in both gas engines. You can put it in the engine. You can use it in the transmission, diesel as well and it's a detergent-based flush. It's the same detergents we use in our oil, so it's much, much less harsh, and it's safe enough you could use it every time if you wanted to. We get upgraded to AMS oil, all the detergents you want and need are in there, and you're not gonna need to use it every time. 
All right, so we are back just about 15 minutes. So we'll go ahead and shut it off and we'll get start uh, getting this stuff all flushed out. All right, here we go. So we're gonna fill up the fluid transfer equipment here. We're using the, uh, the Amsoil heavy bottle, strong guy, Joe. I know you're working out, pumping iron, getting swole. So we're using the Amsoil. Let me get uh, the Amsoil Signature Series low viscosity, fuel efficient transmission fluid. Perfect for this meets and exceeds the OEM specs and perfectly designed for the heavy, heavy abuse. Look, there it goes. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at that beauty, beautiful color there. So designed to just give you maximum protection. Works great in the coldest climates. Works great on the hottest days. Joe, am I right? Heat is what killed these transmissions, right? Heat and cold. Heat and cold, right? The coldest days starting up. And then when you're stuck in the snow, that's when you're going to burn these things up here. So this is going to give you so much reserve protection, reduce that heat, heavy load, construction vehicle back here. This thing's hauling, it's towing, it's idling on the dusty job site. Just absolutely getting beat up there. And that's why we're using the Amsoil transmission fluid. So we're get that thing in, we're going to start doing that full fluid exchange. So Joe, let me ask, do people change their transmission fluid often enough? No, not at all. Not at all. Why not? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, sorry, I'm putting them on the spot. But hey, it's one of those neglected things, right? We're all brainwashed to change our oil. Do that often. But as far as transmission fluid, drivetrain fluids, it's always neglected. And I don't know what, what person buys a truck that doesn't go out and do truck things with it, right? So we've got to get in here and do this. Every fluid... Amsoil, best fluid on the planet. We truly, I truly believe that. But every fluid is gonna break down. The question is, is how soon and how often, right? So, well, we gotta get in here and do this and that's why we're doing this today. So while Joe's hooking everything up, great way to see what your vehicle takes and what they use here at Goodyear, the Bay Area. Just go to officeroil.com. All right, perfect. Take it to my webpage. Click on our lookup guide, auto and light truck. Come on down here to 2016. Ford trucks. Oops, sorry, I did Chevy. 2016. There we go. Ford trucks. F-250, 6.2 liter VA gas engine, and it tells you everything that fits it. All your oil, your filters, your capacities, different oil options. Let me get down to the fun stuff. Filters, coolant, transmission fluid. Here's your capacities, look at that. Total fill, initial fill. That's the signature series that we're using there, the fuel efficient. We're gonna move on to the differential, front diff, rear diff, transfer case, right there. We'll do all that next. All right, hey there, Zach. So Zach came in here to say hi. Zach, hey, tell hey us everybody, hi. I'm, uh, I'm the manager here at Bay Area Tire. We're, uh, we're working on Scott's truck here. Um, I think we're doing a couple of fluid services with uh, with Amsoil products. He's a, he's a big Amsoil fan, as you can see. Yeah, what, what gave it away? Yeah, I'd see that. <laughs> so let me ask you, how many other locations do you have? Uh, we have six. Awesome. Yep. So six total locations. Yep. We're right here, beautiful Severna Park. Yep. Awesome. Uh, this is the, the number one location here, but we do have six sellers uh, pretty much Maryland-wide. So if you're on the Eastern Shore, we have one for you uh, up north and us down south so and you can service all anybody's car truck bumper to bumper yep, everything we right? pretty much do it all um other than replacing engine the transmissions but we do have a, a store that does do that so if you do need that then well perfect we got you covered well, there too well perfect yeah come in and see zach come in joe's back here there's joe he's waiting for us so but come in here and see him and make sure you tell him officer oil sent you <laughs> they're coming here they're going to get you squared away thanks, thanks for stopping oil. thanks Appreciate for stopping it. by zach thanks man all right, fire up, Joe. 
how it's all hooked up and everything. You see how dirty the fluid was when it's coming in. Yeah, let me let me change it. All right, so which one's the clean here? This is gonna be the dirty fluid. Okay. This is gonna be the clean fluid coming in. Okay. Okay. Yeah, gotcha. So we're just exchanging that all out, replacing the replacing the old with the new. So Joe, yeah, this fluid doesn't even look that bad. You already had AMS oil in here, and it just shows you that reserve protection and how well it's really holding up. Because I'm sure you've probably seen some pretty nasty trans fluid, right? It looks like motor. Oil. I mean, looking like motor oil. And geez, you can't even. I mean, it's still nice and red here. I mean, look at that. There you go. You can see the difference there, but not too bad. Yeah, buddy, look at that. Getting it done. All right, so it's all transferred out here. As you can see, we got the, the dirty up top, which was the dirty, which is now matching the clean. So we got good clean fluid in there. So we know that it was all exchanged. Everything was, everything was pushed through there. Joe in there getting it, getting it all hooked up. Yes, sir. All right, here we go. Getting out the old fluid. And kaboosh. Nice, yeah. Got some color to it. Getting it all out. So while that's draining, going to be using the Amsoil Easy Pack. So we took the transmission fluid, put it in the nice Easy Pack. Less mess, less waste really easy we're going to show you how easy it is to put this in there and how quickly it's going to make life joe's life a lot easier so the quality of this it's so good it's built so well and so robust look at that severe duty service double the vehicle manufacturers severe drain intervals in passenger cars and light trucks so whatever your owner's manual says, if you're doing heavy towing, off-roading, we can double the interval with the Amsoil Signature Series. And that's why we're running the best here in this construction truck. All right, Joe, put her on in, easy pack. What do you think, not too bad? Easy as anything. Easy as anything, look. Nice squish it in there. Great less job, Amsoil. Less mess. And a heck of a lot less mess. Get all that in there. Nice. One down, one to go. And number two. Get it in. Look at that. No mess. Nice. Easy peasy. Fill it up to where it fills. Yeah, that's right. And that's it. There we go. It's all full. Coming out, dripping out. How's our level? Great. Good? Perfect. All full. Joe getting it all tightened up. All right, moving on to the rear differential. And get everything, uh, all that old fluid drained out here. Joe's taking it off. And it's a good thing, because it looks like we got a little leak going here. Hey, gaskets go bad, seals go bad. Gotta watch these things. There we go. All that old fluid, here she comes. There it goes. How's it look, Joe? It's a little dirty. Have you seen worse? I've seen milky, I've seen them. Milky, pitch black. black. Milky is when they get water in them. All right, yep. 
So good. So we'll let that drain out here. We'll let that drain out and then we'll get everything buttoned back up. So while this is draining out, we're going to be using the Amsoil 100% Synthetic Severe Gear 75W140. Built for the absolute worst conditions you can think of. So those extreme pressures, rock, cr rock crawling, pulling a trailer in the mountains, you name it, beat the heck out of it. The Amsoil Signature Sear or the Amsoil Severe Gear is the best and the benchmark for your vehicle. So if you want the best, stop in here to see Bay Area Tire and get your and get your front and rear dip taken care of. But the Easy Pack makes it super easy. All right, works GL4, works GL5, works in the limited slip applications. Absolutely outstanding for towing and severe service. And that's what this construction truck is doing. So that's why we're going with the Amsoil. Getting it all cleaned up. Get all that old gasket material off. Cleaning it up. So Joe, how often are people changing their front and rear diff fluid? Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Again, it's neglected. We don't think about it very often, but if you're running this truck the way it was designed for, it's going to need change. we got to get in here and change this out. Come in here and see them down at Bay Area. They'll take great care of you. So we're running out to get some more gasket. They're going to come out, send some more gasket maker, and uh, we're going to move up to the front there. Off to the front. Here it comes. There you go. That doesn't look too bad at all. What do you think, Joe? That one is very clean. Very clean, that's right. Amsoil was already in there. Already had the Amsoil, but hey, since we're under here, we're going to get it all done. Because it, it, it was time. Look at that. Looks brand new coming out of there. 133,000 miles of severe duty abuse, and it's only been changed once. Look at that. Already had the Amsoil severe gear in there. Joe's cleaning it all up, removing all that old gasket material so we get some fresh sealing on there. All right, so we're just letting everything drain out of the front and rear diff. While things are cool here, we're moving over to the transmission pan. So there we go, we're draining that out. There we go, look at that, did a great job. Nice. Joe's in here getting off, the, dropping the trans pan. One fastener at a time, right Joe? One at a time. And here we go, bringing it down. You will get wet on this ride. Bringing down that filter. You all right? We got it. The camera got it, Joe. We got it. <laughs> How are we looking? Other than you being soaked. All right. The filter's got a nice dirt film on it. And you can see the filter inside. Okay. Got some dirt in it also. All right. Definitely need to be replaced. All right, need to be replaced, but pretty normal. Yeah. Very no, normal. No metal flakes or nothing like that. No metal flakes. That's right. That's what we want. So while he's doing this, remember we did the flute, the transmission flush. So we have to do a full, we gotta make sure you drop the pan. Gotta drop the pan, you have to replace the filter and do a full fluid exchange. We gotta get all that out of there. And Joe agrees with me, best way to do it, this way we're pushing, especially even if you're not using the flush, do the fluid exchange, then pull everything down and replace that filter because this way you're not pushing clean fluid through a dirty filter all right so just 
Better way to do it, again, we're gonna have to add and top off for the initial fill, but it is just the best way to get all, we're not putting that, we're not getting that dirty fluid, we're not pushing dirty fluid through a clean filter when we're doing our fluid exchange. Pan look, not bad, how's the magnet? Got a little, little bit on it, but not too bad. Not too bad? Normal, otherwise? Oh, yeah. yeah, very normal. Always gonna have a little bit of something. Yep, it's all gonna wear a little bit, that's great. That's great. Construction abuse. We did have the AMS oil in this, but we just did a drain and fill. So we didn't do a full fluid exchange, so we never quite got all that old fluid out of there. But we do now. Get it all cleaned up. Get all Almost dirty. there. Or fresh. Nice and fresh, nice and clean. Joe, you all right? Yeah, I got a little bit on me. Got a little bit. Messy job. Thank you, Mr. Joe. New filter going back on. All right, so Joe's all done. He tightened everything up, torqued it down on the transmission pan. We're moving over, getting some new, getting some new gasket sealer on the front differential. Working it in there. Joe, you definitely have the touch, that's for sure. Definitely. Getting it all sealed back up. And we're back to the rear differential. Get it all sealed up there. It's all nice and clean. I'm pretty, it's pretty safe to say I think we got every last drop of the old fluid out of there. Wouldn't you say, Joe? It's been dripping for a while, so it's good. Get all that old fluid out of there. Getting ready to get in. Amsoil 75-140. Joe, how long you been turning wrenches? Uh, all my life. I started with my grandfather. Uh, I've been good years since 1996. 96, okay. Day I retired since 96. Yeah, nice, nice. As we love to say, thank you for your service. So is it pretty safe to say you were probably running around with in diapers holding the wrench? Yes. All right. All right. All right. All right. First, uh, first, first easy pack. Amsoil 80W90. Squeezing her in. Less mess, less waste. No need for a pump. One down. And number two. bit more. How's it smell, Joe? It doesn't smell that bad. Doesn't smell too bad. All right. It's full now. Air comes out. All right. Nice. All right. We're ready. Rear differential. 75, 140. There she goes. Still no funnel. No funnel. No need. go. Look at that. Perfect. All right. Last one. There we go. It's full now. All right. Bringing it down here. Getting it filled up. Gear oil's in, transfer case, transmission. Now we just gotta top off the transmission fluid because we replaced that filter. There we go. Getting it in, getting it topped off. Nice and clean. Getting it all filled up. All right, so we're gonna work through the gears. Got it all started up. Park reverse neutral drive. Make sure our fluid looks good, nice and level.
All right. How we looking, Joe? All full, nice and clean. Got to take right. it for test drive, man. That's right. All right, Joe, we're on the test drive. Hey, how's it feel? Shifting good, transmission fluid staying nice and cool, not getting hot. I barely even feel that thing shift. Yep. Nice. Feels like a brand new truck. That's it. That's it. 133,000 miles of severe duty abuse. So nice and smooth. How's our temps? Our temps fine? Temps are nice and low. Nice and low. Good. Good, good, good. Perfect. Brand new truck. But not. <laughs> That's right. Ready to be in service. Ready to get back out there. Again, running the Amsoil. Going to save you time and, time and money. All right. We're going to be able to go longer safely improve fuel economy hey we'll take that right anything any little help we can get at the pump but cut your gas because we're going to run cooler run cleaner run more efficient all right so that's a wrap we're all done here we got zach we got joe we have also zach we have two zach so all done come in and see come in make sure you come in to see bay area tire and goodyear zach i know you got several other locations where else can we go see you? Uh, Savannah Park, Glen Burnie, Pasadena, Eldersburg, Gaithersburg, and Cambridge. Awesome. Lots of great choices. Come on in. Make sure you tell them Officer Oil sent you. Get your trans service done. Get your, get your gear oils done. They'll take great care of you, covering all your auto and light truck needs. Make sure you comment below. Tell them how great Joe did. Look at that smile. <laughs> Love that smile. Great job, Joe. But we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot.